Today I take my Lego Hogwarts Great Hall and combine it with the clock tower to create this medieval mansion mock. Let's take a look. Hi, I'm Brick to Rick. Welcome to my channel for Lego ideas, inspiration and instructions. Please check out my other videos for castle stuff, pirate theme builds and seasonal ideas throughout the year. Please subscribe. So my medieval mansion mock started off with this old Dumbledore figure. I replaced his hands and his head and then decided to make somewhere for him to live. I took a really good look at the inventory from the Great Hall set from Hogwarts and decided there wasn't quite enough pieces so I combined it with one of these clock tower sets from a few years ago. This is what I came up with, a medieval mansion. I think it's quite a striking model and it's got a very detailed interior. But let's start with the outside. From this angle you can see that it's quite a deep model front to back. You can see that the details on the front of the model extend round the side. On the first floor you can see a resemblance of the clock tower with this really nice printed part for the clock face. Above that you can see a castle inspired roof. Now I have to admit that the overall layout of this model was inspired by the Home Alone Ideas set and I'll show you why. The front of the model has these large doors which open out on these hinges on the sides. Let's take a look at the other one now and this allows really easy access to the rooms on the ground and first floor. Obviously you've got the main doors there as well and these open out again to show you the atrium and the staircase. On the top of the model is this castle inspired roof which is fully removable in a modular fashion to allow easy access to the first floor. Here it is moved to one side and you can see what I mean. In this next shot you can see that the doors are open to allow really easy access to the whole model and from the front you can see light streaming in to highlight the details inside. On the ground floor you can see a large table which has been laid ready for a feast and this is in front of a roaring fire in a rather ornate fireplace. Here you can see a shot of the atrium and a statue leading to a staircase. On the other side of the atrium we've got an office area and a lounge and at the back you can see that there is a desk and a quill ready for some writing. Now here you can see a brick built staircase going up to the first floor and on the landing you can see a display area for loads of different antiquities and a cauldron. Next to that you can see that there's plenty of books on those library shelves and I had to keep Forks the Phoenix. This complements this writing bureau and that comfy chair to sit at. At the end of the corridor is a fully furnished bedroom complete with storage. So that's it, a mansion mock for my medieval sorcerer. Many thanks for watching. Please tune in next week for my cart bonanza for the castle theme. I've made quite a few so stay tuned.